Hello, we're going to do another problem for PTVN tables. Uh, this time is going to be a scuba diving problem. So we are starting out with our lungs at a pressure of 760. That is sea level, 760 mm Hg, that's standard pressure at sea level, and a volume of 6 liters, which is the volume of your lungs. So, and when you scuba dive, as you go down, further into the water, your pressure is going to increase. So the pressure is going to increase, and in fact it increases to about 3,040 mmHg. Um, as you're going down, we're going to say that's our, our uh, increase in, in uh, pressure. Uh, we want to know what will be the volume of our lungs. So we don't know what our final volume is going to be. It didn't say anything about temperature in that problem, so we're going to assume temperature is constant. And it didn't say anything about number of particles, so we're going to say number of particles is also constant. So we're going to do some particle drawing right now. Um, we know that we want pressure to increase. That's what we want, pressure to increase. So when we do these particle diagrams, this is going to be our initial. Um, we want, if we want pressure to increase, um, there's a couple ways we could do it. We could increase the temperature, but that's not possible to us because our temperature is constant. We could increase the number of particles. That's also not possible because we have that as constant too. So really the only other way to increase the pressure is to decrease the volume. To decrease the volume. So if we have the same number of particles in each of these, and we have the same temperature, like so, if we decrease the volume, we are actually increasing the pressure. So we are decreasing the volume to increase the pressure. So knowing that, we're going to take 6 liters, and we want our pressure, I'm sorry, we want our volume to go down. We want our volume to go down. So if we want our volume to go down, that means that we need to have 760 mmHg on the top, and 3040 mmHg on the bottom millimeters of mercury cancel out and that's going to leave us with 1.5 liters which is lower than 6 liters so as we as our pressure increases as we go down under into the ocean our lungs are being compressed they're being squished together to a volume of 1.5 liters Kind of scary when you think about it, isn't it?